box hover slider effect. We continue with the box, and in this video, we will discuss the slider effect on mouse hover, which you can apply to a box and grid cell. This interaction is very popular. For example, you can show the text on a semi-transparent background on mouse hover. If you have a box and want to show other elements on mouse hover, you can use this hover slider effect. Add the box from the Add panel. Go to the box, click the box or press the Alt P. Resize and align the box. Change box background. Go to the property panel and change the box background to the image. Click on the image icon on the box or image button in the property panel to open the change image dialog. In the dialog, click on the Pixabay tab, enter nature or click quick search and pick any image for the box background. Go to the property panel and scroll down to the animation section. Click hover slide link. On the panel, check the hover slide checkbox to enable the effect. There is also a quick solution. You can add the box with the enabled hover slider effect from the add panel box section. Now, we will insert elements into the hover slide. You can add elements from the add panel. Also, you can use the hotkeys. While holding the alt key, press the 2 and T to add heading 2 and text elements. Click outside the box to unselect it. Then hover the cursor over it to test the hover slider effect. Click the hover slider and go to the property panel. You see the blue check mark near the hover slide link of the animation on section. Click on the link to open the hover slide panel again. You see the presets that you can apply to the hover slide transition. Select the flip preset and test it. You can also change the hover slide background to a gradient, image, or video. Or you can change the color, for example, to blue. For the selected color, you can change the transparency. Make the background darker and the effect more visible by moving the slider left. Lastly, you can modify the duration property to shorten or extend the transition time. Test the final result by clicking outside the box and hovering it back. We have finished the lesson about the hover slider effect for the box element. Remember, you can add the same effect to the grid cells. Subscribe to our channel and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn. Thank you for watching.